Hello, everybody. My name is Gothic Gamers Girls here. Welcome to um, something different. So, if you guys have been on TikTok or anywhere on the internet, you've probably heard about uh, this. This is Pink Sauce, and it was made by a TikToker by the name of Chef P, who's a private chef and basically is someone who doesn't know what FDA stands for. That's all I'm gonna say. So, basically, what what is Pink Sauce? Let's go through that first. Um, pink sauce is basically, um, something, if, uh, basically, like, runny peptabismol or something like that. It is, like, supposed to be a dipping sauce, a normal dipping sauce, but it got popular because of its unnatural color, which was pink. And, um, if you guys know anything about dipping sauces, they're not that pink. They're, uh, they're hardly pink. I don't even think there is a dipping sauce that is pink. But this dipping sauce was pink and once it was revealed to the internet the internet wanted a squeeze of this thing and then wanted to go back to the nearest um yeah then they're trying to go to the nearest bathroom because um um either the pink sauce has been exploded or well exploded in the bottle it's either uh rotten or spoiled or it's either gone bad or um, something has happened to it something here's a few weird things about the source which is um basically on the nutrition facts and the ingredients there uh, firstly in the ingredients they're all listed in the wrong area so if you try to make it yourself it's gonna come up uh, out of some like purple reddish um glob of liquidy watery mm, shake which it does it's a trip for your taste buds that's all i'm gonna say but also if you look at the nutrition facts it says it has 444 servings of it which obviously is wrong because um if you've looked at any other dipping sauce obviously it's not gonna have 444 servings per dipping sauce uh, per portion in it and um basically it says it has one g of of sunflower oil fat and zero of every other uh, oil fat and that would make sense if all 444 servings were literally the size of a pea then yeah sure it would check out but I don't think that's true also um basically I don't know if you know this but basically chef P doesn't know how to do math or something like that um, uh, um there is 11 plus 4 uh, calories or something I don't remember which in total it says it equals 3 but it should be equaling 15 which obviously that's wrong um, um there's also some binding agent or something that goes with the pink sauce to actually make it like um like pink dipping sauce kind of thing uh, which um honestly she doesn't have in the ingredients which can be really bad because someone could be allergic to this and she just doesn't put it on the ingredients and she sends it to her them um also another thing that um happened is that she was making a TikTok of forcing people to try it. Forcing people. If she if they would not accept force. Um the, yeah she she would be forcing people to try out the runny Pepto Bismol aka pink sauce. And they wouldn't like it. Uh, uh, you would see like a few people saying mmm before they even took a bite and then they would refuse to look at the camera and they and um she would force them to say good things about them. So they would say, Oh mm, very delicious and you could literally tell. Like if I'm going mmm Mmm You would think there's something up because I wouldn't I obviously I wouldn't be probably wouldn't like it. Um uh, the reviews about it are just so negative. And um, you shouldn't consume it. If you look on a page that talks about um, it, it says it can give you botulism, actual botulism, which is um, just wrong. You just, uh, it's just wrong. Also, if you go to her TikTok, it will say she will say she does she she can't tell you the ingredients she used to make it pink, but it's pink, which she kind of does have to tell us the ingredients. Uh, I already told you that before, so I'm not going to go over it again. But basically, um, here is a few other things that uh, you might notice um, when you see the pink sauce. It is never the same sauce twice. Sometimes you can see like like particles in it sometimes you cannot sometimes it's a different shade of pink and sometimes not um so that is kind of weird just to think 
uh, that it's like that. Also, one person who was doing, uh, was making pink sauce with her said it was a prototype. And obviously, you're not supposed to be selling a prototype to the uh, to um, the world. You're supposed to sell the final release of whatever you're uh, selling uh, to uh, the, for, uh, to uh, everybody. It's it's been a prototype since 2022, the first of July or the fourth of July. Uh, and if you if you if you're judging the prototype, you're judging it good because obviously you're not supposed to be eating the prototype. Let alone people are not supposed to be selling prototypes. Have you ever been sold a prototype? of ketchup before i don't think so um have you been sold something like a prototype of honey mustard or mayo i don't think so that's the thing you're not supposed to be selling prototypes to the country you're not even supposed to be selling prototypes to the entire world this could be really bad and it could go really wrong um and there's so much about the pink sauce that just makes it look nasty to eat sometimes it comes to you rotten they um, a lot of people haven't actually had the song, uh, the song, uh, song, this is a song, no, uh, they haven't actually had this pink sauce, 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 not sauce, uh, not a song, no, um, some people haven't actually had this sauce yet because, um, uh, lately the packaging and the, uh, delivery system has been so riddled with errors that uh, a lot of stuff hasn't been delivered to people, which is just something, um, and yeah, that's basically in the entire video. Don't try pink sauce. You should not try it. It is dangerous to consume it. Um, so do not try pink sauce. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you smash the like button, smash the subscribe button together. We can stop this pink sauce mayhem. Because we already know that Chef P is not ready to launch this. Let alone launch, um, make a sauce company. Or be a private chef. Maybe a private chef, I'm not sure. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you smash the like button, smash the subscribe button, spread the word, spread the pink sauce word to everybody, and bye for now.